remarkable how something with a positive intent can end up having the opposite effect, but given the journey CD Projekt Red and Cyberpunk 2077 has taken to date, perhaps this latest comment by CEO Adam Kaczynski isn't going to land quite the way he thought it might. Speaking to TVN24.pl, the CDPR boss explained that they would continue to work on the game and introduce improvements to the general systems that players are paying attention to. He went on to say that, We have already achieved a satisfactory level in this regard of stability. We have also been working on the overall efficiency, which we are also quite happy about. Of course, we also removed bugs and glitches, and we will continue to do that. And this is sure to probably anger some fans, especially those playing on base model PlayStation 4 or Xbox One consoles, as the game still carries a warning on both stores explaining that users might experience issues on those versions of the game. In fact, Cyberpunk 2077 only just came back to PlayStation's digital storefront, and the company's vice president wouldn't be drawn on the stats for that version yet, saying, We do not provide detailed, partial sales data. We provide data when they reach milestones or accumulate to a specific amount. So we're not going to be finding out how many copies they've sold on PlayStation just yet, it seems. But it also seems that the initial comments about stability were intended to be a good news story, but as with so much of this game's journey to date, people won't be happy. But much can be lost in translation too, and Polish fans of the game have said that the translation suggests that the company is more happy with the progress so far, rather than satisfied with the overall state of the game. One way or another, Cyberpunk 2077 isn't going anywhere, and for more on this game and every other game out there, head to NME.com. Thank you.